Hello everyone, welcome back to Ogo Power. I'm Ogo, and this is another episode of Far Cry 6. And. Ah, there. Yeah. Um, after considering it, I think I will go for room service. I don't know if there's a correct order or something, but I just thought, well, I haven't done anything for her in quite a while. I need you to go to the Grand Hotel Caballero. It used to be a resort for wealthy touristas, but Benitez converted it into some sort of prison torture hellhole. One of our fighters, Hugo, is being held there, which means Hugo. he's got an appointment with the dentist, the regime's best interrogator. Ow. If the dentist gets any information out of him, we're fucked. He's got a good heart, but Hugo will crack like a fucking coconut. You need to stop that interrogation, whatever it takes. I already sent a scout to the hotel. She'll help when you get there. And one of Gilberto's people can get you past the guards if you hide in the back of his delivery truck. But you better hurry. The truck is leaving soon from the delivery yards. Okay. Benitez can't find out where we are, Danny. Shortcut. <laughs> On this one and I'm in position. Oh. The dentist is already in there with them. Yeah. I thought dentists were always late. Not this one. Crap. Okay. I misread this. Oh well, I guess it could be worse. Freaking kidding me. Like that was the dentist. Yelena, the dentist yeah, is dead. It was. La morale is safe. That's fucking great news, Danny. Oh, and I'm working on a gift for you. Gift? The hotel. I'm taking it. They have tortured their last guerrilla here. You sure you're not La Morale, Danny? I'm just saying. Some fun, Chicharon. Chicharon, over here. <laughs> I think that was the last one. Come here. <laughs> I 
I guess he's enjoying himself. What do you want the people of Yara to know about the conflict? <laughs> conflict? It's business as usual. Look, in spite of all the rumors going around, there's no war. At least not here in Eastern Yara. Am I right, Admiral? This is not a war. Yeah. The criminals of La Libertad will be stopped. Yeah. There are few, we are many. You hear that? And... Libertards? This means chica. She means business. And what about the violent gang known as La Moral? Anyone the... who attacks Yara's military That's a woman? or a business interest is not a true Yaran. My strategy... And I helped her with the strategy. I've got decades of experience. I ran a security firm. The East is safe. Am I right? Right. No prea capas por nada. That's a cut. I gotta go. Señor Presidente. Admiral, so lovely to hear your voice. If I could ask, how is it that a group of school children in El Este are inflicting the highest number of active duty casualties of this war? <laughs> Admiral? They, um, they have support from Libertad and the Legends. I've always taken a personal interest in your career. Handpicked you out of the Academy. But make no mistake, there were more experienced, more qualified, and more intelligent officers in line before you. You stood out for one simple reason. Si, señor presidente. You were a woman in uniform. And now, you could be the highest ranking woman ever to have her head on a pike. Gracias, señor presidente. Higher! I want them higher! I guess... That's problematic. Okay, so it was a bit too late to get you compound bow. Those are quite mean usually. Said. I guess that's what we would have found out about if we had gone with it with um, the truck. Okay, knuckleball or national treasure? We will see. <laughs> I guess we'll just do the one that's the one I just get. <laughs> So, and it in. it's knuckle. There's these farmers in Sombrero Gorge. They're super fans of La Moral. Actually, they're super fans of me. They were part of my fan club when I was on the national team. They tipped us off to this special convoy that always rolls through Shao Pass. We put together a smash and grab attack plan, and I told my super fans to sit tight until they hear the word knuckleball. Nobody knows what this fancy combo is carrying, but we know it's valuable. Benitez always slams it with crazy security. A hundred soldados. Danny, we need you to hit the convoy. I'm sure you can handle this all by yourself. But if you want some help, my people are pumped and ready to go. I'll keep tabs on the convoy and let you know when it's near the pass. Don't know about you, but I fucking love Let's hearing convoys. Let's talk. Not now. You know what? You know what I'm gonna do. Airdrop and then move over. It's just very useful doing it like this. Um, 
One, two, three. Yeah. I think again I might have hey, Danny. been supposed to do this different. To hit the pass? Remember, say the word. Don't worry about it. Not yet. You think I can't do this on my Wait. own? We need people to feel like they're here. part of this fight. They have the RPGs you need along with other badass shit. And remember, there's no I in team. But there is an I in win. <laughs> I guess everyone in El Este can go to the beach while you're overthrowing Castillo alone. I'm kidding, Monron. I'll think about recruiting your super fans. Gracias. Oh, <laughs> Castillo. Okay, Drop the coconuts. Knuckleball is a go. Bingo. I thought this day would never come. We need to piss off Benitez and spread out her forces. Music to my ears, guerrilla. See you at the pass. I'll bring the road spikes. Perfecto. We get to use them. Nice. <laughs> Go. Don't worry. I'm a friend. Yes, I am. When I say the word knuckleball, what's that remind you of? Setting up an ambush at the pass. Fucking up the convoy. Taking whatever they're carrying. I'm fighting with Honron. Carajo. You're ready. I have been waiting to get the go-ahead for months. Vámonos, Gary. Hasta la próxima. What's up? Oh, like I said, I have been waiting to get the go-ahead for months. Vámonos, guerrilla. I've been waiting to use my rocket launcher. RPG is locked and loaded. <laughs> so, or is he? Vamos. That's it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah. Chill a bit, horsey. <laughs> Does the word knuckleball mean anything to you? It sure does. You want us at the pass, right? Si. I'll meet you there. You're the one who saved our people on that cargo ship, no? <laughs> That's me. My cousin was one of them. Muchas gracias. De nada. Let's go get this convoy. I'll get my mortar. Mortar time, compay! Easy. Oh, sorry. Where is the shop pass? Ah! Oh, oh, not to the east. Ooh, Torsi. Ah, yeah. 
I'm guessing Elena will have Whoa, now. I thought I heard something. <coughs> but something very loud. <laughs> Very fast one too. I don't know if I did it correctly to be honest. <laughs> Jackpot. I mean I don't think I did it. Rooster loose too wrong. Going to help I heard you hit that convoy. See? Interesting. And Ron's heading your way with the cash. Good job, Danny. Any battle we get will go a long way in this fight. Admiral Benitez has increased patrols now, so watch the roads. Okay. Hello. Que bola. Um. Then let's go for national treasure as well. Nice one taking the hotel. I've been telling you. Just, I like this young daddy ass. They remind me of, well, me, only smaller. And it's going to take a lot more than a basement full of little me's to win this war. The time has come, baby tigre. We need Carlito, the fifth legendary member of the 67th Revolution and the toughest motherfucker I ever knew. <laughs> Soldados would kiss their pantalones when they came face to face with him. You know the expression, two birds with one stone? Well, Carlito once shot down two planes with one bullet. He is a national treasure. That was before he retired and went to work in the museum. The regime has put him in a cage to be insulted by filthy true Yaran Turistas. Okay, I think his true destiny is on the field of battle. He's either I'll meet you at the museum. Together we will free Carlito from his prison. It's either a weapon or a rooster. Castillo has many bullets, but we will have And Carlito only needs one whatever. So I drop. Whoa. Oops. 
El Tigre. I'm at the museum. So am I. If you want to see photographs of us when we were young and dumb, put your gun away and walk in like a tourista. You know what? Let's do that. What's with that bird? Hello. Hola. Come on, I don't bite. Coffee or tea? Ah, I see Santa. It's boring here. Is it a tank? Oh, Hola. Please. The... What? Oh. Can't believe I left my own tiger. I didn't think we were... Hola. I know the question on your mind. I'm surprised that's this many people the evil one from this from, What's from the uh, Far Cry 4. Uh, Pig and Min, I think was the name. Mm. Is that the oh. Poor kid never had a chance. Another day, another job. Hola, baby tigre. Hi. Stay strong. Less obligé. <laughs> uh, I, I just want to have a look at it. Nice. Yeah, still nice. Hell of a rooster you got there. First lion. El Tigre! Is Carlito a fucking tank? Por supuesto! What were you expecting? He's Carlito! Oh god, it is a freaking tank.
breaking tank. This is just awesome. <laughs> Carlito the tank. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, Carlito, I love you. You came! What the fuck is he doing here? I wanted him to see Carlito for himself. <laughs> we come by. How many <laughs> years since you've been down this mountain? Too many. Carlito and I, we have a lot of good memories. Time to make some new ones. You should join us, hermano. War is over. When we are all free. <laughs> Come on, means no. brother. Come on, it's gonna be good. I'm good. Come on. Okay. Yeah. Nice. So, um, let's see what we will do in the next one. Not entirely sure yet, but we are done here. So, I want to thank you guys again, and I hope to see you again in the next one. Bye-bye, my friends. <laughs>